Yo what's up guys it's Atrix here today in this video I'll be talking about Cassi emulator news and I'll be giving some information which has been revealed by developers officially on their main discord server. Now let me talk about the minimum requirements of Cassi emulator android. I'm guessing that it will be android 12 or above minimum because most of the windows emulator for android like box 64 droid etc need android 12 version also win later uh, if you have a rooted device which is above android 10 then you can use box 64 droid. I'm guessing that it will be same with Cassia as well you need minimum Android 12 or above if you want to emulate Windows on Android now I don't really recommend you guys to use any other Windows emulator for now like box 64 droid uh, Exagia definitely don't use Exagia win later as well it's not really optimized the performance is really poor on Adreno 7 series Android devices on win later and hence I do recommend you guys to wait for Cassia emulator now speaking of waiting let me talk about the release date of Cassia emulator it hasn't been confirmed yet but the developers are trying their best to release the emulator as soon as possible but not rush it at the same time there are very few chances of Cassia emulator releasing by the end of this year because the developers are busy they are trying their best to work on Cassia emulator as much as possible but there are a lot of stuff that needs to be done before for example running wine on android it's not supposed to be easy they are making an emulator which will be way simpler than box 64 droid and win later as well they want to do a lot of things to improve the performance make the emulator stable and as Cassia will be closed source or maybe partially open source they won't be providing alpha builds anytime soon my guess is that we might get first ever Cassia emulator build by next year yep not this year because it takes a lot of time to develop these emulators. It took them 3 years to get the first ever commercial Nintendo Switch games running on Skyline emulator which were Sonic Mania, Bastion but Windows emulator on Android will be little easier as there are many emulators that can be used as reference. For example, Fex Emu, Box64 Droid, Winlater. There is a reason behind me telling you guys to wait for Cassia instead of using winlater or box64 droid that's because it will have the best in class performance as they will be using arm64 ec right here you can see one of the main developers of cassia emulator has informed us that by laws another developer is focused on cpu emulation end of things while he is working on getting wine to work on android which will take time as i told you guys before there are already some emulators for reference for example fix emu so the main developers will probably use it as a reference and it will be faster compared to box 4 droid another amazing part about Cassia is that Mali GPUs will be supported so I am guessing it will provide almost as good performance as Snapdragon devices hopefully that hasn't been seen before because of Mali GPU not being well supported in terms of emulation now as I was talking about the release date of Cassia the developer has officially mentioned that they are planning sometime in 2024 for the release I'm probably guessing it will be 1st January 2024. That would be pretty cool because I remember on 1st January 2022, they released the first ever Skyline build which was capable of emulating commercial game like Sonic Mania. The developer has also mentioned that he can't really compromise on his job with Cassia and other developer can't do the same with Uni. So they are trying their best to make it all work. So in my opinion, I would recommend you guys to wait till the next year and we would definitely see Cassie emulator with playable results and, and supporting many Windows games like GTA 4 and even possibly GTA 5. There are some gameplay screenshots which I'll put on screen. This is Cassia being tested on a laptop. Not as powerful as the developer's main Android device but still it's pretty fun to see that some games are working properly with Cassia. So that's going to be it for today's video. Thanks for watching. Make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, turn on all notification as I'll keep you guys up to date with all the latest emulation news. With that being said, see you guys next time. Goodbye.